I'm having my first ever grocery shopping. I am so tired. I had to walk miles to find this place. I met someone who recommended this place, this shop. Um, it's called Canadian Superstore, I think. So I'm here. Here to see if I can get a few things. Because buying food has been very expensive. So, yeah. Because it was my first time shopping, it was a little bit stressful because you know I had to go around and make sure that I've seen everything so I can pick exactly what I need. And also I'm on a budget, I'm not trying to, you know, go broke. And remember, I was telling you in my previous video that you have to buy bags here. So the two bags I took were not enough. So I had to substitute it with my school bag. And then I just want to show you some of the things I got. So that was um toilet roll or tissue paper. I don't know how you call it. But that was toilet roll I got. And then I found Oku. I was so excited. So I just bought it. I didn't really have plans for it. And then some tin tomatoes, bell pepper for, you know, orishi or whatever. Then some um Ziploc bags. I think that's what it's called. And if you know me you know i love coffee so i go coffee and then also these things that they put in sandwiches and i don't know even what they are called but i got some of those and then i got rice i saw this basmati rice buying the rice was so difficult because you know there were so many options hey what is this you know you know anyway i hope you know and then vegetables because i'm on a diet and i love vegetables and i got cooking spray i am trying to use less oil so cooking spray for the little little frying and then olive oil because the canola and the vegetable oil i'm done with that life that was all that was in this bag and oh and then the, i got some garlic for you know cooking so let's move on to the next bag in the next bag I got this brioche, it's a brioche, it's a thing, bread. Take it like that, bread. I got one and then I got this cabbage. Hey, the vegetables in this country, they are weird. Hey, they let me keep quiet. Let me keep quiet. <laughs> and then I got yogurt. Yeah, once again, because I'm on a diet and I'm trying to be careful about what I eat. And then I got this peanut butter. then i got some chicken yeah i got this chicken was really affordable i think it was about ten dollars or something like that and then this beef beef the beef was so expensive i don't know if like there's a shop where i can get it for cheap but just this cut was 40.67 as you can see i think it's so expensive if there's anyone in the comments who knows where i can get cheap um cheap meats or beef or whatever to buy please help me now this is 40 dollars a year means me in your beer. <laughs> i got this onion because i prefer to eat um like vegetables than using them to cook plenty so i got this one because you can use this one to cook either ways and then i got habanero pepper i hope i got it right and then that was more tin tomatoes and then i got coconut water i've had this coconut water it tastes like coconut water yes but as if it is real coconut water meaning and then i got some cucumbers too 
and there's some fresh tomatoes and one decided to fall. That particular tomato was planted in Senior Break. I'm so sure about that. I went for my thing, jar. And then I also got uh, um, some salt for cooking and then more um, Ziploc bags. And then some apple juice because I saw it. And then the apple juice I had in my hotel was so nice. Remember when I got to start breakfast? So when I saw this one, I'm like, let me just get it. It's probably the same brand. <laughs> I got two of the coconut water. Yeah, and then lemon juice. I know this brand, so it wasn't you know a problem picking it. I got lemon juice. I can use it for cooking. I can you know mix it up with my drinks, everything. Yeah, lemon juice is an essential commodity for me. And guys, if you watch my my weight loss videos, you know what this is. It's a um, no sugar water enhancer that I put in my water to make it taste like drink and so far i love it so much initially my mom used to get them for me but then coming here and seeing i can buy it myself i was so excited and then i also got some freezer bowls from dollarama i passed by dollarama it wasn't so far from the canadian superstore all these things i got from dollarama that thing is for you know clothes because now all my clothes have become very close so when they grow those things that's those clothes go i use it to clean it and then they sent the candles i also got it from dollarama they smelled good so i couldn't resist and they were affordable so i got that and then i got this towel too because you know i just go here and then i had some cleaning to do and all of that so i got this fiber towel to you know be cleaning with them and i saw these things and then i don't have enough space i don't have like you know whatever I, I don't know you know what i'm saying by the time i'm done telling you what this is about so i plan to pack my stuff inside and then stack it under my drawer so that i can you know organize my things and i decided to take the time to show you some of the things i brought from ghana i don't know why the video didn't capture everything but i'm just going to see some of the things i brought i brought dried fish I brought dried shrimps, I brought some Tom Brown and then seasonings and what else? Kobe. I brought Kobe. Yeah, just a little. You know, I'm not I'm not so big on food ingredients because I feel like I can survive in this country and the food that it has to offer. So these are my seasonings. Pepper, kakra, mentia, kakra, those things there. Even though I've seen a shop where I can get all those things, but I have some and i brought some more spices because that's that's what i like to use now and some maggi cube that's the beef some more beef and then rimi fish i brought just a little because i'm not really a fish person and then this is some more oh, seasoning hey all pepper seasoning yeah i was trying to open this one my best friend wrapped these things for me and <laughs> the way she wrapped it in <laughs> it took blood sweat and tears to open up the packages B. anyway the shrimps are for me so if i eat it i've not killed anybody so i got some things from the canadian superstore but i didn't get everything i needed so i decided to go to food basics to get the rest of the things I needed. I
If you ask me, um, pork, I mean, meat at um, Canadian, I don't even know. I don't know, but I just think meat is expensive over here. This for 20. Uh, I don't know what to do. This for 12. Uh, I mean, I should also consider the fact that it's just me. Uh, do not take too much. So I think I'm just gonna go with this one. This one. Okay. Hi, I'm looking for oatmeal. Oatmeal? Yeah. I should be Right there. Okay. One. Thank you so much. Finally found the old news. It was all the way down. So, hmm, three forty nine, six ninety nine, two point five kg, nine hundred grams. Different so. Ooh, okay. So, let me just take this one so that I can eat it for long. Yeah, I think I'm done now. Oh, there's coffee mate. Uh, anyway, I think this one is cheaper because I got this one for like six, almost seven dollars, and the coffee mate is that. I mean, it pays to try some. Oh, uh -huh. look, this is what I got, six ninety nine, and coffee mate this size is six forty nine. So. I think I'm just gonna go with this one. Yeah, so let me get out of here before I buy something else. It's 2.98 per pound. I just need a little. So, I got home from food basics i didn't get so much i ended up buying this pork because i decided that it was just me and then i bought some dishwashing soup and then some bacon for breakfast i guess 
and then some ginger. I got the salad dressing and then I got a couple of seasonings. They were quite affordable so I bought some because I needed them. Yeah, paprika, thyme, curry powder, what else? A whole lot. Ginger powder, onion powder. Yeah, I think that's what I bought. And then I got coffee creamer for the coffee I bought from the Canadian Superstore. And then I saw this diet drink. For me, the once is zero sugar, the account me in. I bought one of that and then the oatmeal for my swallows and breakfast and some other things. And then I bought a few eggs as well. And that was it for food basics. I didn't get so much. Like I said in the beginning, I'm not trying to go broke. So I bought only the stuff I needed. And that was it for my first grocery shopping. See you in my next video, guys. And thank you so much for watching.